I think you should live into the professionals. But we can't right now. We're in quarantine. Pretty good. She hates us. <laughs> She's mad at us because we cut her hair last night. She looks so ugly. This is oatmeal. Ah. We think she's a Maltese and a poodle mix, so she is called a Maltese poo. Ding, ding, ding. She's fun and playful. Our groomer has been closed because she has all of these knots in her ears. She's a little trim on the behind. Yeah, you don't need your <laughs> this is my dog, Journey. Ah. Journey is a golden retriever, so she doesn't need to be cut with clippers or anything. Really? This girl really? loves to be dirty. She is just gonna have to be cleaned up in a lot of various places so she can have a proper golden retriever look. Our dog's name is Cricket. <coughs> and she's a Fitsu <coughs> Pomeranian. We think. We think. No, she we is. adopted her. I think she might have some Maltese, but. No, she's a no, Fitsu Pomeranian. She has the type of personality where, like, you know she cares what she looks like. Yeah, she's a diva. We found these, like, huge matted areas, and that's when we were like, okay, we have to do something about this. My dog's name is Bear. <coughs> He is a Sulasa op, so Bear is super playful. I feel like he's a little Scottish boy. Other people think he's like a British soldier or an old man. His hair tends to like grow into his eyes and this is gonna be very interesting for him. I already know that I'm gonna do better than Chris Evans because I don't have to use clippers. So she will not be walking away with bald patches. Our dog's haircut will be better than Chris Evans because he did not do a very good job. Sorry, Chris, we love you. We wish you luck. luck. We got the clippers and we like put out a towel and we like we watched a couple videos about how to yeah, do it like, as though that's gonna help. How to plan of attack. I've also never held a pair of clippers in my no. life. We've like I didn't even know which way to put them. I we, we literally did not know what we were doing. Right. So we started and it, it like at the, the her like back part of her body was like okay. But then when we started to do like her underside, it kind of got scary and she was not happy. And she was, I think in pain. Also got... the clippers said they would cut through the mask and they did not. Usually I have a groomer that comes to the house. So I am going to attempt to do what she does just from what I've seen. So I bought a buzzer and it says super easy with turbo mode. So my plan is I'm gonna brush them first. I'm gonna set them on the kitchen counter. Kind of relaxing, right? I already know I might have to headlock him to get his eyes. And then hopefully that'll kind of just like get out the wiggles and then I'll be able to just like buzz him. You're doing so good. We're doing this journey. We're doing this and we're getting it over with because I'm tired of messing around. Doing this at ground level is really hard and my back is aching and my knees were hurting. Don't judge me. But I have my knee pads from when I played volleyball in high school. And I'm gonna be down on Journey's level a lot for this haircut. So I broke out the knee pads. So let's get our area ready right here. I think it'll be good if we put some trash bags down. Oh God, I don't know how they do this. One chunk down. Okay, now I feel like I judged Chris Evans a little too harshly because this is really hard. <laughs> There's so much fur. She still needs more cut. I mean, cause you're not like this with the groomer. I wonder if it's cause he knows me maybe, so he trusts me that I'm not gonna do anything. I'm surprised, he's kind of just acting like I'm brushing him. I was so surprised he was falling asleep. I thought this was gonna be like deep breaths, headlock holding him down. No, he was falling asleep. <laughs> I messed up her foot. I don't, I should have watched more than 10 seconds, but something ain't right with her foot. Journey, why can't you stand like this golden retriever? So I'm gonna keep cutting. This one looks better than the first one. Her poopy areas are where her personality is. You don't wanna take that kind of stuff down too low. So I'm glad I was able to do it myself and make sure I didn't do too much in certain areas. But yeah, that was definitely definitely harder than I thought it was gonna be. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try to figure out a way to stick this to the wall somehow, put some peanut butter in it, and it gets stuck in these little crevices and it takes the dog forever to lick it out. And hopefully it'll keep Omo busy while I try to cut her hair. Come on. Good girl, good girl. 
I think the good thing about having a curly haired dog is that you can't tell if it's super botched. I posted an, uh, a video on Instagram, like six people <laughs> messaged me and they're like, you know the groomers are open, right? We were like, we did not. We did not. Um, apparently they are, so we are taking her this weekend to get to get correct to get fixed. She did not enjoy it. It was not enjoyable for us. I know everyone's probably gonna judge us for doing it, but she looks mangled and look at that face. Okay, so final thoughts. Oats can see a little better around her eyes, so that's good, but her head definitely looks shrunken. It'll grow back, don't worry. I'm so desperate to get back to her old groomer because it was hard. I will say that leave it to the professionals. Journey and I both had glow ups today. I couldn't let her look good and I didn't. Definitely a win, but she looks good. I didn't get it perfect by any means, but she looks really clean and, and like sleek, which is exactly what I wanted. Oh, do you like your new haircut? They do a better job than mommy and mommy. Oh, you look so much better. I'm sorry we butchered you. You look so much better. We're sorry. Sorry. His fur is like the really soft carpet. Like you can just like run your hand back and forth. That's what he looks like now. He doesn't look like a hot mess. I honestly think I'll continue to do it at home because when I was using a stylist, it was a very stressful experience for him. But he was falling asleep. It's just way more relaxing, less stressful all around, so I'll probably just keep doing it myself. I'm covered in fur, but I'm very proud of myself, and I'm very proud of him.